Okay, one of those saves, and I guess we'll go back to the, uh... The elevator. Suitably warned. <sighs> Alright. Oh, Egbert! I'm so excited! There's only one note left! Hmm! Hmm! You're right, Egbert. The last magpie did say something weird back there. He said something about not being able to turn back? Hmm. I'm so close to the truth. I better make sure I'm ready before I see the owl about the last note. Maybe I should make sure I've done everything I want to back in the forest. Okay, super hinting. I've gotten most of it, uh... I want to go back and see if I can find those last two feathers. Well, these two feathers. Between the boss's feather and the chef's feather. And I'm pretty sure they would be on the beach. Uh, beach. Uh, sorry. Cavern and then beach. But I'm not sure. We might use the magic of the internet to look it up. Songbird Symphony Feather Locations. Cheating. <laughs> okay, what to do, 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 do. Some random website. Okay, so we have... Alright, so it looks like one is in Vice Paradise and one is in the Volcano. And since that's a video guide, I don't have any further details beyond that. We'll just have to explore. Oh, it's down there. So how do I get there? Probably a false wall somewhere. But, hold on. Oh, I need to go down after the... Not a balloon woods. used to be an adventurer like you, and I lost all my money gambling. Alright, that is... Okay. So to get there... Hey kid. Hello. Oh hey there, what's Chick doing in a place like this? I need to find my parents. What about you? Oh, me? I'm trying to find my bird seeds. You seen any kid? Maybe I should go. <laughs> Wait, really? Is it just that? Okay. Kookaburras. Tickling yourself with this feather will surely make you laugh indeed. They see themselves as the comedians and entertainers of the forest. You can always look to the kookaburras for a laugh. <laughs> Okay, so from here back to the volcano. Oh yeah, some of these rooms were suspiciously large, but I don't remember which. Like this. There's no reason for this room to be this big. You are hiding things from me.
There it is. Unidentified bird. This greasy long feather looks pretty brutal. Who does this feather belong to? All right. So there's a whole other bird also in hiding that we have not seen. The guy that I found did say his, his, their name, but doesn't mean anything to me, so. But I'm gonna guess he's not in the same room. In fact, I'm gonna try for the exact opposite side. Just in case. I'm just gonna hit that safe though. But this room was pretty small, actually. As I recall. Oh wait, this room had stuff going on. Lots of suspicious balloons. Okay, I think I tried hugging that wall before. Inside this one. Hmm. Not on that side. It doesn't look like here. Hmm. done some of this. So we're still looking for a hidden bird. Somewhere. Could be... Hmm. 
Give me some kind of hidden wall. Ah. Do puzzles all over again. Yeah, that just gets me around. Right, this had a suspiciously, uh, not for me area going on. And it's not going to get any better with the thing already being gone. It's also possible he's in that same big room I found the, this feather in, but usually there's at least some remove, right? Right? We found a lot of places we could keep going further up with. Lots of opportunity for stuff to be hidden. but bouncy lava there. All right, it's probably not this room. So we like saw stuff going on here, down here. 
I am suspicious of this area. What's up with that color? <laughs> there we go. There we go. There he is. Rock on. Whoa, what are you doing here? Look around, you kid. Flowing lava, balls of fire, it's all so... so metal! This right here is my natural habitat. The perfect place to shred. Sounds cool. Cool? What are you talking about, kid? My passion is burning red hot! My wings flying across the fretboard when I play a face-melting solo. That's what I live for. That's... metal. Now you're getting it, kid. Yay! Oh, this must be your feather! Right on! It's your feather now, kid. May the spirit of metal live on through you. Uh, rock on? Rock on! <laughs> See, you're back. Back for some more egg stream shredding? Oh, that's a good one. I'll give you that one for free. I'll remember it. <laughs> All right, Metaliburb revels in places that inspire his heavy metal spirit. Raka. Okay. So I think that might be everything findable. <laughs> there are still spots after the magpies, but that's after the magpies, so they probably don't do anything yet. We've gotten all the notes. Oh, 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 oh. I might have enough to go to that area in, uh... Pascalis Palace. Where the woodpecker lives. See if we have enough notes to open that door. Before we go see the... Ooh. Across the water. One more gondoliering. The elevator just goes to. Wait, no, the elevator doesn't go to Gallus Palace. What we do is we go all the way to the top and jump off the balcony, as I recall. not designed for this.
I saw that. The peacock or something looking over the edge at us. Out. Oh, it's you. On the Emperor Rooster's order, you may pass. Thanks. This is the way out from there, okay? No! I still need three more. Which I guess mean, means I need a whole other area then. <sighs> All right. Apparently the end of the world. Ah, uh, but it doesn't go back this way, do we? We have to go onward. switching songs like that that fast. <laughs> First magpie. Alright. To our doom! Oh, Edward, I'm so excited. You're not egg-sighted? only one note left. Huh. Huh, you're right, Egbert. Last magpie did say something weird back there. He said something about not being able to turn back. Hmm. I'm so close to the truth. Better make sure I'm ready before I see the owl about the last note. Maybe I should make sure I've done everything I want to back in the forest. Okay, I think we have done pretty much everything. The only thing that we haven't quite done as much as we wanted to was get an A on the uh, the pixie song, the pixie chick. Uh, but I can't, uh, it didn't give me the opportunity to replay it, so whatever. All right, Owl. Hello. Uh, there you are. Finally. I'm back. The penguins and blue-footed boobies were having a contest. They didn't really like each other, but things are fine now. Yes, yes, well done, Burp. Now the note, the note! The wiggly fingers! Oh, okay.
Piggly mm, fingers. Oh no! Yes, yes! So close, I can almost taste it. Soon I can finally rid the world of the songbird once and for all. And then I will be the only one with mastery of the power of music. And the forest will once again know order by my wings. No! Oh, he wants me instead. Uh, Elsa? What are these things doing? Well, Burb, they're just... Wait. What is going on? That's not supposed to happen. I should be the only candidate! Well... Burb, tell me, how do you feel? Like I have overwhelming power? No. Any giddiness? Nausea? I think I feel fine. I do feel like singing, though. But that could only mean... Hmm. Of course. Why did I not realize it before? I was blinded by my excitement. Ow. What's going on? You're scaring me? Burb, I found the answer. I know what your species is now. You do? But why are you speaking like that? The only ones who have mastered the power of music are also ones who can effortlessly sing like every bird in the forest. Magpies? No. They're wretched. Obnoxious. Arrogant. Scum of the forest. Songbirds. The species responsible for turning the forest birds into lazy, good for nothings, using their power to help out. But all I do is just overindulge everybody else and performing for them every other day. Such a wasteful use of that power. It's borderline ab abuse. Should be the one who wields that power. I'm the one equipped with the wisdom. And so I will finish what I started. The wicked grin on the face Please. of a bird. <laughs> Rid this world of you just like I did to the rest of your kind. You won't be leaving here alive. No. No. Yeah, that's not happening. Oh boy.